haven't spoken to you yet today. Um, it is Tuesday today. I am just um, making up some new planet stickers. I designed some of these I've had um, sketched out for ages, but at the minute I'm just doing a pastel birthday one um, with some balloons, presents, cupcakes, uh, candles, and then I've put two happy birthday ones in the all the colours and then I've done a couple of birthday and a couple of hooray um, but I don't I think I've called it pastel birthday because I think I'm going to do like a bright rainbow one as well um, yeah but is this something that you would like and let me know what other colour options you, you would like because I know not everybody is as into pastel <laughs> as I am so um yeah if if there is another color way that you would like um because this for a, a couple of my planner stickers that's one thing I want to work on this year is my planner stickers have more options available so I've got um this is like this is my procreate document that was here so I've got some weather ones to do as well and I've got some paw prints that I'm going to do in pastel and bright rainbow it and this one and the weather one let me know what other plan stickers you would like um I have got quite a few ideas of ones written on that one um there's a couple of my sticker sheets at the minute that I am shrinking down to make as planner sticker ones as well have I got one open to show you yes so I've got this, um, the Care Bears one, is, I've shrunk them down um, to a couple of different sizes to do that as a sheet as well because the sheet, the original sheet of those has got one of each Care Bear and then some hearts and things um, <clears throat> to fill in the spaces but um, when I was putting them in my plan I thought it'd be cute if there was like a little version that would fit better so um, this done, I've done those. And I've done the same with the dinos ones. They had um, some plants and stuff um, around them, but they were bigger than that. And then, yeah, I think that's it. That's all that I think I've got up. I can show you right now. But um, that is what I am working on today. Um, yeah, I did have a tidy up yesterday. A bit of an organised tidy up. Look at all this floor space. There is a couple of boxes and stuff here. There's like two two corners that are opposite to each other that need organising. So we've got this corner here that has got um, wrapping paper, some gift boxes down there as well that I need to organise. Um, my market Christmas tree and banner, my market boxes and stuff, and some mugs that need sorting out. And then there's this corner as well, which has my um yeah that i need to organize as well and my desk on my side of the desk um in particular needs organizing but it is a lot better than it was um i put my catnip planner um calendar up um i haven't populated it with any information yet oh one thing i do want to do today is print my sales tracker um and i need i'm gonna actively make an effort to do that this year and I think I might do I don't know I don't know whether to do a separate one for markets I don't know I don't know whether to because um yeah I don't know whether to do like an online sales tracker and then an in-person sales tracker um for the months that are relevant like this month I'm not doing any markets in person um, is there anything else I needed to speak to you about? I do just know. Um, I've filmed a reel as well this morning. Well, I've done the video bit. I need to edit it all and everything. Of all the pins I've made last year. Shall I show you? So all of these pins on here are the ones that I made last year. So this one was technically up for pre-order at the end of December, but it was made last year. Um, and then got the four pins out of the kickstarter this is probably this little guy is probably the, been the most popular um of last year and then i've got the this set um 
my first pearl swirl pin. My collab pin with Andy and Laura from Keep It Local. It's this is my um, my personal one. Um, they're only available with them. I don't think they've got many left. <clears throat> and the last one of the year was Jack's house. Um, I have. That's another thing I want to do today. Actually, I'm going to message my manufacturer and see whether they're, when they're closed for Chinese New Year. Um, because I think that's soon. I'm pretty sure it's like next week or something. Chinese New Year, and that they can be closed for quite a while. Um, because I have new pin designs um, that are going to, uh, I'm going to get a quote for, um, so I might get the quote for that today, it might be tomorrow, and then I can put them up for pre-order once I know how much they are, um, but I just want to double check the lead times with it being Chinese New Year and they shut, the factory shut over there um, for that holiday, so I'm going to get back to doing the, um, some more of these planner stickers, I have got a new blade for my Cricut. Um, I did have some new blazers before Christmas. My sisters got me because they were sick of me complaining. <laughs> um, but I don't know what. I don't know if we just got a faulty one or what, or whether it's because I normally get the premium one and they were the normal ones. I don't know. But it just they just haven't worked. Um, there was some stickers I did. You know, a cotton. I don't think you'll be able to tell, but it's like not cutting smoothly it's ripping the vinyl which is really frustrating because i didn't realize until i'd done a couple of sticker sheets and that stick paper was not cheap so that was frustrating so i'm gonna um test those now because i have got a daisy sticker sheet that is due to go out um yeah it looks like i'll have loads of daisy ones for myself or um i might add them to my seconds stash um ready for when i next do a second sale yeah, so we test test the new blade, I think, um, to see if that solves my cricket issues. Um, and then I'm going to have to make it more cosy in here while I work on the planner stickers. And then I can actually cut some, if it works fine, then I can actually get some cut. So let's do that. Finished and it's definitely sharper as it's completely cut. It's completely cut out. Is it cut out? Um, oh yeah. <laughs> oh no. It's cut them out. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh. Um. Yeah, I need to change the pressure settings because that's the settings I normally have. For sticker sheets so it goes around the stickers once and the backing sheet three, three times okay okay <laughs> oh i've got to pick all them off now 
Oh, right, I need to, I'll try again in a sec. <laughs> in just a second, because I've got all these daisies off. Ugh. I noticed it was cutting through, so I cancelled it and changed the settings. And this time, I'll be playing unloaded the map. This time, it has, I can't do it one of um, ignore that. But they are. I'll do 100. They are cut. The stickers are cut through. But it doesn't go all the way through. So I shall have this one with the missing one. Excuse the fact that I look like an egg. My hair is annoying me. Um, I've done the first year wizard planner stickers and the foliage planner stickers. I'm not sure when my next shop update will be at the minute. I'm, I'm hoping the end of January, but it is already the 11th, 12th, something like that. Um, so. I need to have enough time to promote everything so which is what I'm trying to do this year is not just um, work work on everything to the last minute and then have no time to actually market what I've made um, so that is what I'm trying to do this year and um, next week's vlog we shall be making more stickers i've got the dino ones ready to cut already and um, i've got loads of dots ones and i've got some new ones that i'm working on and um, that will get them all print and cut ready for whenever i decide the shop update will be i also need to do some sampler stickers so we'll work on them for the planner event that i am attending next month so yeah that's all to come in next week's vlog. But thank you so much for watching and I will see you next week. Bye!